What's going on guys, it's Dan here, and welcome to Dirt 3, one of the only games in the Dirt franchise that I never actually played, well, if you subtract uh, Dirt Showdown, I never played that one, that was more of an arcade style game, so I opted out of that title, but anyways, we're here to play the game, I'm a huge fan of Rally, Rally Racing, and I love this franchise, it's just so much fun, I played uh, mostly Dirt 2, uh, I beat the I beat that game in full unlocked everything possible But I never played this one. I can't remember why I think it's because I was just starting out and on YouTube and I, I didn't feel like racing games were Something to draw the eye. I don't know. I could be I could be tripping, but That's probably had a lot to do with it But I am anxious to play this guy. I think it's gonna be a lot of fun. Mr. Ken Block. These guys should seriously make another one. I don't know why they don't. Hi, welcome to Dirt 3. Hi. I'm Ellie, your business agent, and we're really excited that you've decided to sign with us. Now, before we move on, let's get your details for the contract. Copy. All right. My forename is Player. I'll just do all capitals, because that's how they roll. Uh, D <laughs> I'm wondering if they went kind of like realistic rally in this one. Now watch, my name's going to be in all caps and everyone else is going to be in smalls. Male. I'm not English. Why do you assume that? There she is. All right. Audio name. What the hell does that mean? Oh, there. Dan, boom, right there. Experience, I don't wanna go casual. I think I might go intermediate. We'll see how that handles. You call me Christian, and if you stick with me, I'll I don't care. you into a racing superstar. But that's gonna be hard to do if you don't have a VIP code. Without that code, you can't put your race footage on YouTube or race online. You can get one by visiting the main menu anytime. Yo, okay, enough I beg to differ Buckle about YouTube. Nacho, this bitch is going on YouTube. Blast. I don't need you. <laughs> yeah, enable that. I'm going to have to turn off the music in this game. Like, not so much the theme music that's playing right now, but, like, the music, the actual in-game, like, audio tracks. You know what I mean? They're actual songs by artists. got a great feeling about this. If you're ready to start the Dirt Tour, the first championship series is waiting for you. Or you can also check out multiplayer for some totally awesome racing. What'll it be? Well, we can't do multiplayer just because, well, I'm apparently a rookie bitch. Uh, audio. Music. I know that sounds lame, but... One second, there's something we can do about that, actually. Uh, profile, maybe? No. Vibration, audio, HUD. Although I've never played a Dirt game on the PlayStation 3 before, and that's what I'm doing right here. This is on PS3. Obviously, because it's an older game, it's actually kind of hard to find. I mean, it came out in 2011, which is only three years ago, but it's hard to find. Like, I, got, I can't believe I've ended up finding it. Okay, my dirt. DLC. No, cancel. Fuck that. Extras. I don't know if this is gonna. Nah. You know, we'll just leave it off. That's fine. My, uh, my, you know, wonderful. I'm just amazing, okay? Fantastic. We've signed you up to a four season contract. Here's an overview of what you can look forward to. Selecting the season will show you what's currently available to you. Okay, season one is what? Probably basic rally? I wonder if they have the same type of rally racing they did in Dirt 2. 
start off your first season, I've signed you up for the Alpine Stars Trophy. It's a great place for us to get noticed. Sounds good to me. Let's do the Alpine Stars Trophy right now. And here's Jack. Let me introduce you to your chief mechanic. Hey, nice to meet you. Let me know which event you want to compete in, and I'll fill you in on the details. How many races we got? Four total. Okay. Rally is a skilled, fast- I love rally. rally. Rapid fire staggered starts means that your opponents are just around the corner, so keep an eye on who's doing what. The races are point to point, and the stages take place on a variety of terrains and landscapes that will challenge you technically. Anticipating what's next is the key to success. Finish times are added across the stages, so every second counts, literally. The shortest overall time wins. You know what, now that I think about it, I probably could have got this game uh, on PC. <laughs> I totally didn't think to do that. Oh well. It's all good. Cool. Based on your driving record, a couple of teams have contacted me. They're both great teams, but we'll have more to choose from as your driver rep increases. If you want to increase your reputation, just pay attention to me. I'll turn you into an international sensation in no time. That's fine, Christian. Thanks. Look, why don't we let our driver choose a team? Okay, so I can go with Castrol. They have a Peugeot 207 S2000. It's got 280 BHP. It's four-wheel drive. These vehicles are basically the same thing. I just don't know if I want to be driving a Peugeot. Chris Meek won the Intercontinental Rally Challenge in 2009 with the Peugeot 207 Super 2000. Its robust engine and dynamic chassis make this a formidable choice for all rally stages. Huh. Go back. Alright, but then there's Osiris and I get the Abarth Grand Punto. Little Fiat. I get a higher objective bonus. Winner of the inaugural Intercontinental Rally Challenge in 2006, the Fiat Grande Punto Arbath Super 2000 is a fantastic car that continues to be competitive to this day. Hmm. Perhaps then I should take Osiris. I think I'll go with Osiris. Great, let's get started. God, there's no sound. Well, there is. There's just no music. I mean, I don't know. I don't want to risk it because I think, because just wait till I'm signed with someone else, guys. We won't have this issue anymore. But I don't want to, I don't want to risk anything. Welcome to Finland. This is one of the most iconic rally locations in the world. There's no shortage of jumps, so make sure you don't lose control. Some of the greatest rally drivers have raced here. It's home of the fastest rally stages in the world. You know what? The Finnish are the craziest, they're like probably the best drivers this is in the, the world. Service area. You can find information here about the next race. It's also where you can adjust your difficulty in a assist <coughs> and tweak your vehicle setup. I've provided you with a balanced setup to start with, but feel free to have a look and adjust it to whatever suits your driving style best. If you need more info on anything technical, just select it. Finish at 137k or faster. Difficulty, all right. Advanced settings. Damage is visual. I think we'll leave it for now. Racing line. Stability. Just for starters, and then I'll change it off. Yeah, just, just for now. Okay. That's fine. Um, vehicle setup. I'm probably good with this. Gear ratio. Downforce. Depends how much slip you want, really. I'm good with it right in the... It's, I guess once I start... If I feel like I need to change something as I'm racing, I'll, I'll do that. So, All right, hold on. Sorry, I just want to... Okay, entrance. Look at me, number one. Hey, look, they're all capital letters, so I didn't fuck up this one time. All right, let's do it. This is going to be nutty. 
Here we go, baby. One second, before we do anything, let me just see something. Options, audio, speech we need pretty loud. HUD. Usually they give you a, uh, I don't know. Okay, <clears throat> that's fine. Oh, very bad. Son of a bitch. Not a good start. Very not good. Gotta keep this bitch on. Just wait till the cars get insanely hard to control and super fast. Oh, hold it! That was too wide of a drift. That moron could have got. He's gonna get hit! Fuck off! Oh my god! Don't. It wastes your reverse, your flashback. I don't know what I'm doing right now. No, don't care. Like upload to YouTube your your sick shit. Whoa, no! Oh my god, man, this is not. I'm such a rookie at this point in the game. That's two. That's three, actually. There you go. There you go, take your time, don't be stupid. I gotta listen to her instructions. Nice! First place, look at that! Not bad. A couple of flops near the beginning, but... Did I? Oh, I did finish at 137k or higher. Nice. That's my bonus. Clubman Shield. Into the dirt. So my first race complete. Kind of bumpy at certain points, but we're getting there. We're getting there. I wonder if there is any intro music. I mean, at least, like, just something that I'll be good to post. I mean, it sounds so quiet. Because that's all that would be playing right now is the intro music. Er, you know what I mean. Oh, shit. I didn't see the objective. Let the Persia go ahead. Go. See you later. My little fiat. Okay, beat a time of 1 minute 32. Alright, I got that. Got to stop. Oh, not the tree. Oh, that's bad. I was like running over everything. <laughs> okay, I think I'm gonna be going in this too fast, so I'll hit the brakes as soon as we come back. There we go, not bad, not bad. Medium 
Nice. Keep it in. Very good. I'm going to catch up on this motherfucker. I got to overtake the Peugeot. Move over, French i I'm coming through. Woo. Whoa! <laughs> and we beat the time too that we needed. Bam. Wow, a podium in your first event. Outstanding. That just shows how beast really I am. To all the hype, mate. Great job. Thanks. I love trailblazing races. There you can get so much speed. They're like massive courses, like in Utah and places like that. There's some awesome new downloadable content available. Oh. Why don't you take a look? No! I tell you? Keep racing like that and you're going to be a household name. And more importantly, more teams will want you to race their cars. Brilliant work. The Mud and Guts Car Pack. Coney Motorsport now. Wow, he won. Let's get him on our team. But anybody could drive a Fiat. It's an Abarth. They're really upselling their DLC, aren't they? Hey Dan, you've almost qualified. Stay focused and keep your eyes on the prize. Is this the actual trophy? Yeah. All right. American Rally X Crown Smelter. So Rallycross is your good old frantic multi-car circuit racing. Your tracks are short sprints and made up of a mixture of surface types for some intense in-your-face racing. With cars that are both quick and agile, this really is all about the overtakes. Be the first to finish and the glory's yours. That rally cross. Oh, it's one race. All right, so this Fidanza. They're going to give me an Impreza STI. 556 bhp this is 555 that's an evo evo 10 i pr i like the evo 10 over the sti it's one horsepower purchase the focus that's not even fair focus st rallycross if i had the if i got this one it was new i would have had this car i think i'm going to take the objective you know the bonus. But they changed up how it was. There was way more customization in uh, Grid 2. And I've barely played this game so far. I would not mind to have an Evo 10 as a personal vehicle. You can't really go wrong. I mean, yeah, there's always flaws, but it's not a bad car. Welcome to Michigan Smelter. This place might look like an abandoned wasteland, but it's actually home to some of the most challenging races in the world. Industrial tracks give way to off-road conditions, so there's no one way to win any of these races. Expect the competition to be fierce. Rally cross is pretty common too. Some people don't consider it rally. And I totally understand that, but... I totally missed the objective. Jump a total distance of 60 meters, is that what it said? Come on, Evo! What the hell is that? God, this turning is insane. It's really light. Go, baby! I'm in sixth? What did that happen? Oh, he's going off! Woo! Oh, 
Oh shit! Woo, that drift! This is my kind of racing. Get your punk ass out the way! There you go. Whoa, she's losing control! No! Oh. I, I think that's a bit of, uh... Please don't go off. Oh, no! Fuck! How did I do- how am I doing this? There you go, I don't know. Weird, okay. Oh! Woo! First place. That was pretty easy. <laughs> who just kicked some rally cross butt? You did, that's who. Are you sure this was your first rallycross event? Because you look like an old pro out there. Well, I did play Dirt 1 and 2. Back when they were known as Colin McRae, Dirt, and Colin McRae, Dirt 2. <laughs> I don't know. Dirt 2 is the best one, in my opinion. I mean, I haven't played this one very much, so I can't really make that assumption, but I'm sure a lot of people would agree with me there. So yeah, the more unused flashbacks you get, the more rep you get. Pretty standard. Alright, so what's next? Is that you gonna give me a trailblazer? Yeah, I think so, it's in That's Kenya. The way to do it, superstar. You qualify for the final and rock the podium to boot. You're unstoppable. DC is That's a head to head surprise waiting for you. Your own personal. Hey, don't give away the surprise yet, Christian. Thanks, Jack. Yeah, keep racing as well as I know you can, and you'll find out what it is. Okay, well, I want the safari. I want to do this. I think this is, uh. This has to be, um. Trailblazer. Is it? I'm not sure. The Lancia Stratus. Oh, man, I really want that car. And they make it a DLC. Fuck you. It's ridiculous. The Opal Cadet, the Fiat 131, purchase the Ford, Ford Escort Mark II, the good vehicles they put up for, <laughs> that's greasy, this must be another rally, um, this has more horses, this has better objectives, and this is a lighter vehicle, they're both rear wheel drive, hmm, 20 BHP can make a difference, and so can 50 kilograms. Fuck it. Taking the Abarth. We're going two for two with the Abarth. Mishimoto. <laughs> These things are so old. Oh, that gear shift. Look at them. Into the lights. Come on, baby. Welcome to Kenya, home of the Safari Rally. There's only one way to describe this event. Hot. Temperatures are going to be boiling out there on the plains, and those rough surfaces are going to give you a tough workout. Hot. It's just like, there's not as many people. There used to be like crowd and everything. I mean, there are, but. There you go. Let's go, baby. <laughs> Gotta watch the corner cuts. Or it'll go off. At one point, there was this dude I used to work with, and he thought rally racing was NASCAR. 
That's what he thought it was. He's like, I don't get rally. It's so stupid. It's just in a circle. I'm like, do you even know what you're talking about? Shit! I can recover from that. Oh, that's bad. That was... Ugh. Hairpin. Oh, I got that shit unlocked. Still good. Come on, baby. And they actually have an in cockpit view for this bad boy, which is pretty cool. So they never really had before. I mean, they did. They did like it's like with the steering wheel and the shifting and everything. Oh, I still got first, <laughs> even with a couple mistakes. So like, yeah, it's all good, buddy. It's all good. I am ready. I'm gonna have to do some research because I feel like there needs to be some sort of tunes here. Because I mean, I just, I mean, in game music that's licensed for it should be okay. But if it's like, like I said, like it's, they have the rights to use it, but they don't have the rights to put it in anywhere, you know what I mean? To, to distribute it, then I'll have an issue. Fuck. I remember when you never had to worry about any of that. I could play a music game without any problem. Now everyone's fucked. And even a music game anymore. Reach a speed 140. I haven't done that yet? I guess not in this bad boy. Gotta get that rally feel. The turning is way looser than any other racing game in rally. I'm surprised she's not using numbers. Like they usually give you like... Um, like left six and that would det determine the severity of the turn and the higher the number the easier it was and the lower the number the tighter it was so a hairpin would be a one I, no 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 that's not true it's the other way around it's like one to six i think i can't remember the numbers or how it went whoa hit the stone work I want to hit that 140. Damn, I got lucky there. I don't know if I got it. I saw it at like 135 a couple of times, but I don't know if I got the bonus. Oh, I did get it. Nice. I was As looking expected. at it. On to the next. Way to make a name for yourself early. Thanks. <laughs> I saw it. I saw it fluttering right there. I didn't know what to make of it. I was like, ah, it's close. Get that rep boost, though.
Driver rep position first to 10. Did I, did I even use a flashback at all? Huh. Arai off road are interested in you. Oh, okay, new new uh, new team. I keep forgetting about that, but like, yeah. Dirt 2 is way different. The organizers of the Brembo Blast are so impressed by your driving, they've offered you a spot in their next competition. This is a really big deal. Everyone's talking about you, amigo. Your rep is starting to take off. Why would I go there when I could... I'm not done yet. The trophy final. Let's finish right, this off. Head to head is all about you and the other driver. The elaborate crossover tracks means you'll be racing different track sections at different times. This is a spectator event. So pay attention to your huge crossover jumps to make sure the crowd's loving you when you cross the finish line. Knockout rounds mean you'll need to get through the early stages and win the final to be victorious. Like this shit is so awesome. The Dredger Duel. All right. So I got to pick my team again. The Peugeot 207. Or I can go with Osiris Racing. I think I might keep with Osiris. And then if I want, I can come back to the events with a different team. And that, that's, how, that's how they get the replay value in here. But since I didn't pay for the VIP, I'm not a VIP in here. I won't be playing online. Like, that's so retarded. It's because the only place I could find this, besides online, and if I got it online, well, there probably wouldn't be a VIP races thing. Races like these that separate the elite drivers from all the... I had to buy it pre, uh, you know, GameStop or EB... I had to get it from EB Games as a, as a pre-played game, a recycled game. But these are fun. These are very fun. I am ready. Yeah. Team Fiat. Well, Cyrus. Pierre Luigi, I'm coming for you. Medium right long. 40, over bridge. Medium right, keep in. Medium left, long, onto concrete. Woo! Onto gravel. Woo! Too wide. Medium right, very long. Still doing okay. such a lame event don't you think like this one place oh very bad go still in first it's only by a hair though that was my fault i'm pulling away though Hold on. Oh, that was a hairpin. Girl, where were you on that one? Go! Motherfucker's gonna catch up! Oh, that was slow. Yeah, don't matter. We win. Is that it for the cup? Like, boom, I'm done. I win the cup. No. It's a trophy, so I have to do it multiple times. Don't get all that easy. So who am I playing now? Or facing? There's a lot of like... Oh shit, what does it say? Fuck, I always miss that. I'm just so focused. One second. Win and lead by one second. Oh, okay. I think I can get that done. Oh shit! Oh no, that was bad. Restart. Yeah, just because I wasn't paying attention. <laughs> 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 
Woo! Come on. Same shit. Come on. Oh no, what's going on? It's gonna cost me. I gotta win by a full second. Full second, that's all I need. Was it a full second? I don't know. Although I'm worrying about the bonus object. Yes, I did it. Nice. Ruben Martinez. Martinez. Not today, amigo. The Italians and the Mexicans couldn't stop me this time. The true man from the Great White North is up on the top of the spot. Oh, I'm, I'm almost, what is that, level 3 or level 4? Almost level 4. So what'd you give me? He said, they said they'd give me something for that. Okay. You gave me nothing. All right, well, that means I got to do the Brembo Blast. Okay, I don't know. I don't know what that was about, but we'll be back.